Hello, welcome to Tricky Eyes. I'm sure you'll be fine. Today I'm going to share one simple method which will help you to score higher in IELTS listening module. Most students face problems during listening test and they fail to get desired band in listening module. Practice 20 days for at least one hour and you will be amazed with the result. It is more than essential to watch this video till the end. First, I'll share three points where you have to work on. If you if you are able to work on these three areas, you'll be able to secure higher band. At the last, I will share one simple method which will help you to improve your listening skills optimally. Means you have to work on contractions form. For example, means you have to learn all contractions and their correct pronunciation. That how they pronounce. For example, uh, during communication, native speaker they use contractions due to which uh, most students they face problems and they are unable to understand clearly. So if you are able to learn contractions and their correct pronunciation, then you will be able to pick the word easily. Then you have to work a bit more on uh, subject verb agreement. For example, if you place. Uh, a word or for example if you select option and then you have to means match the sentence that the sentence is grammatically correct or not so subject and verb agreement uh, is a bit important pronunciation means you have to listen to various documentaries like uh, British American and Australian means uh, in order to familiar yourself with the pronunciation that how they pronounce a word then you'll be able to improve your listening skill. Now I'm going to share the important strategy which you can apply to improve your listening skills. What you'll have to do, you have to select a listening test. It means you can select from Cambridge series. What you'll have to do, when you select a listening test, you have to do one thing, that you have to listen, that test means, uh, for example, for 40 questions are there, so you have to complete all 40 questions. Whenever you complete the questions, you don't have to read, uh, means, uh, check answers. You should not check answers. Whenever you listen the test, what you will have to do, you will have to write the answers uh, in the answers booklet, but you will not have to compare with the original answers. You have to listen that test at least four times. Means for the first time you have listened, you have written uh, the answers on a paper, then you have to listen the same test three times more. Means you can uh, listen the test after two hours, after three hours. For example, if you, uh, if you listen the test in morning, then you can listen again the same test at noon and the same test in the evening or, uh, or the very next day. So means what you will have to do, when you will write all the answers, for example, the first answer is on one page, the second is on the another page, then at the last, when you listen the same test four times, what you will have to do, then you will have to means check answers. When you will check answers, means as I have mentioned that you have to repeat the same test four times, then you have to check answers. So when you will check answers, then you have to compare answers up, uh, means uh, first time when you listen, second time, third time and four. So means there will be a clear direction. For example, if your answers are improving, for example, when you, you, you lessen the test means for the first time, second time and third time and you have, uh, you got some answers wrong. So what you'll have to do, you'll have to find the reasons that why I got these answers wrong. Means you'll have to find the reason behind wrong answers. So, so means you'll have to count. For example, if you, uh, means commit uh, too many mistakes in the first one, in the second one, in the third one. So when you will find the reasons means behind these answers, so then you, you should just observe that, yeah, uh, did I get deceived by the speaker with a, means with the help of pronunciation with grammar means you will get the reason that yeah means you you listen the words uh, because of uh, pronunciation or you misunderstood the word because of pronunciation grammar or what's wrong there means that you can get when you will find the reason means when you will listen the test again and again then you will be able uh, to find the reasons Then what you'll have to do, you have to check overall score. For example, if your overall score is increasing or not. For example, you listen, I uh, mean, in the first test, uh, you have to compare answer of the first with the second time and third and fourth. Means uh, by this way, you will you will get a clear message that your listening is improving or not. Means you you get uh, more correct answers or not. You are in the same level. What you will have to do, for example, if your answers are like this, in the first test you got 18 correct answer, in the second one 20, in the third 25, and the, the last one 28. So what you will do, 
you will it's mean that you are improving for example uh, in the first test you got uh, option a uh, means correct in the second the same option you got correct and in the third again you got uh, the four, the third one correct means the same option you got correct in three tests but in the last one you got that answer uh, means wrong or incorrect so it's mean that uh, you your concentration is somewhere well else or you are unable to concentrate on the same test what you will have to do for that you have to means uh, listen something in an active manner means you will be active there whenever you will be active you will be able to score higher so it's mean that on the very first day this is the strategy that the first day you have to listen one test at least four times understanding and when you will find the reason you have to apply this the reason in the very next day whenever you are going to select the second test so means you, you will select the second test and you have to means practice uh, mean on the very third day fourth and fifth like this so you have to practice the same strategy for at least 20 days means 20 days you have to listen means if you practice four tests on daily basis so it's mean in 20 days you can practice at least 80 tests which will improve your listening power uh, means or your listening skill uh, optimally or if you are able, unable to do so you should les listen to various documentaries means uh, like uh, with british accent american and australian so means at, on daily basis learn uh, listen to at least four uh, british documentaries four australian and four american it will help you to improve your listening power or listening skills optimally thank you for watching